They were young and happy and apparently successful in their pursuits. The triple homicide stunned this peaceful university town and prompted claims by some that the tragedy was minimized because the victims were Muslims. Civil rights activist Ibrahim Hooper. It goes without saying that if the uh, Muslim had been the perpetrator in this, that it would have been international headlines immediately. Police say the suspect, Craig Stephen Hicks, had a parking dispute with the victims. But he had attacked Islam and Christianity on Facebook. Authorities are still investigating a motive, but have not ruled out a hate crime. In December, a teenager was run down and killed outside a Somali center in Kansas City by a motorist making bigoted comments. American Muslims in general have been experiencing what terrorism expert David Shanzer, who lives in Chapel Hill, calls trauma in a Skype interview. And it's not trauma in the sense of, you know, immediate uh, harm uh, or immediate, you know, psychological damage, but rather just a real questioning about where they fit in in America. And after the wide media coverage of recent terrorist attacks in Europe, many Muslims in the U.S. have been bracing for just this kind of violence. Jerome Sokolovsky, VOA News, Washington.